Alright, here's a kind of an exploded view diagram of the uh, fuel pump here. Uh, there's a cam inside the motor that provides an eccentric that actuates this part here. That's the pivot point that would be pinned by this piece right here, the pin. This is the fuel pump housing. Uh, the spring goes in like this, pushes up, pushes this diaphragm up. You can see I've already cut and drilled this, got it fitted. Um, this uh, moving up and down just more or less sloshes fuel. These check valves are what actually provide fuel movement from one direction in through this valve and then out through that valve. Uh, and this is just a secondary chamber of the fuel pump. Uh, and there's the top part. So it's all this rubber seems to be in good shape. Uh, one thing I did find wrong with uh, the kit, like I said, it was for a Massey Ferguson, probably diesel tractor. These little check valves are way smaller than the ones in the fuel pump. Those are in good enough condition. The main problem was the fuel on the old diaphragm was just leaking into here and going into the, the, the motor oil in the block. So, and it just wasn't pumping fuel. So, here we go. We're going to put it all back together. Uh, the next video should be us running this generator again.